When we think of fashion, we think of models, designers, celebrities, and everything that makes you feel fabulous. You may not believe it, but math drives the fashion industry. From compiling research to identify a profitable market, to developing a product, to determining product specs for production, to budgeting and planning, to allocating quantities to stores across country, to marketing and advertising, to designing store floor plans, to evaluating your business in terms of sales and customer satisfaction, mathematics is critical in moving product from concept to consumer. Without the right combination of creative and analytical skills to guide it, the fashion industry just wouldn't be profitable. Hi, I'm Alexis Michaelidis, and I'm a senior at LIM College. As a math tutor, I've worked with many different students, so I know that it can sometimes be hard to realize the ways the math skills you learn in the classroom can be applied to real life. With Math is a New Black video series, you'll learn from current professionals about how they're using math to solve the problems they encounter on the job. Even as an intern, I recognize the importance of math to our industry. For example, two summers ago, I interned in the merchandising department at Madison Square Garden which is responsible for buying all the apparel for the team stores in the arena. That summer, we were in the middle of WNBA season and New York Liberty merchandise just wasn't moving. The buyers had to use retail math formulas to develop a promotional strategy that would excite the fans to shop, but also increase sales at the same time. But that's just one personal Hiding experience in one area of our business. Let's see how math is using fashion merchandising, visual merchandising, marketing, and management. Hi, I'm Michael Londrigan, Chair of the Fashion Merchandising Department here at LIM College. So why is math important? Math is important because it touches everything we do in the industry. Even behind me, looking at these fabrics, denim fabrics, how do you know how many yards do you have to use to create a pair of jeans? It's all about the consumer. How much can we buy a product for and how much can we sell it for? So if you don't know how to do math, you're not going to be successful in figuring that out. And that's what it's all about, math. Hi, my name is Jennifer Kwan. I graduated from LIM class of 2011 with a BBA in fashion merchandising. I recently started my first job at Roberto Coin, a fine jewelry company based out of Italy. I was a math tutor when I was at LIM for most of my time there, and I learned how important math can be in everyday life. I learned even more so how important it is in my new job as an account executive here. Hi, I'm Dudley Blossom, Chairman of the Marketing and Management Department, and what math helps us do is understand how to look at patterns, how to see patterns and in information, and draw those patterns out so that the data is useful. Right? Further, it's becoming more and more important as we see business move more and more into an online format or e-commerce format or multi-channel formats, right, that we're able to understand how information flows, how numbers, as they become digital, turn into data, turn into information that can be used to help a business person make a decision, understand their profitability, understand their losses, understand how much they're making and how much things cost. Hi, I'm Rebecca Weissman. I recently graduated LAM College in May of 2011 with a BBA in management and a minor in event planning. I was a math tutor for all four years at LAM College. Currently, I am a merchandising production coordinator for Kids Ready to Wear at Ideally. Sell through percent and turnover are important formulas in planning inventory sales since Ideally's only last 40 hours. Buyers need to understand these rates in order to avoid having excess inventory. Hello, I'm Professor Eric Feigen. I'm the chair of the Visual Merchandising Department at LIM College. We're here at the Mattatech Museum in Waterbury, Connecticut, doing a student installation of their work. I've used mathematics every single day in my retail career. Whether I was dealing with a $5 million budget, I certainly need mathematics for that, or figuring out the square footage, footages of a retail environment. I need mathematics for that as well. Dealing with yield of material, or looking at the geometries of a piece of furniture that we're designing. Mathematics and retail go hand in hand. At LIM College, our mission is to see that you succeed in college and beyond. Regardless of the sector of the fashion industry that interests you, from developing a product to displaying it in a store's window on Fifth Avenue 
or launching a new business, mathematics will be essential. Math is the New Black video series will expose you to math applications that go beyond your textbook examples. I'm President Elizabeth Marcuse and I encourage you to join the Math Center in exploring our dynamic industry. Thank you.